This tutorial will walk you through the time-saving grading features within Google Assignments. Let's get started by opening your Learning Management System, or LMS, and choosing the specific classwork you would like to grade. Click the name of the classwork you would like to assess. It will display your class roster with the status for each student's submission, including submission date. Next, click the name of the student whose work you wish to grade. You have all the intuitive editing features that come with G Suite. For example, to provide transparent guidance, you can turn on Suggesting Mode in the upper right corner to track your changes to the student's submitted schoolwork. You can add valuable feedback by selecting text and then clicking the Add Comment button that appears on the right edge of the document. Enter your feedback in the comment box or save time by typing a keyword to bring up frequently used feedback in your comment bank. Select a saved comment from the bank and click it to add it to the comment box. You can add to your comment bank by clicking Add to Bank in the right column. In the dialog box, type in your new comment and then click Add. If you turned on Originality Reports for this classwork, you'll see in the right column which files submitted by the student include passages that match copy found online. Click Flagged Passages under the file name to open the report. The flagged passages in the document are highlighted in gray. You can click a passage to display it above the web match in the right column. Click the link under the web match to go directly to the online source for further exploration. To learn more about Originality Reports, watch the Originality Reports tutorial. If you set up a rubric for this assignment, rubrics will be shown in the right column. You can assign a point value to each metric by clicking the scale below the metric name. The points will tally in the total grade box at the top. Enter general comments in the Overall Feedback section. You can quickly jump to another student by clicking the down arrow here to open your roster. Use the category buttons to sort by first name, last name, or submission status. Don't worry, students are not able to edit after they turn in their classwork. All your feedback and edits are automatically saved, and your students will not be able to view your feedback until you click the Return button in the upper right-hand corner. When the drop-down menu appears, select Return this submission, or you can select Return multiple submissions. When the list of students appears, select Individual Students or select All Students by checking the box at the top of the list. Click Return to send the submissions back to the selected students. Grades sync automatically into your LMS, another way Assignments features help save you time. We hope you found this tutorial helpful. Remember, you can always find additional support in the Help Center at support.google.com edu assignments.